Hey folks, Sasha with Bath & Granite. We're gonna talk about how to repair a bathtub, an acrylic bathtub to be specific. Acrylic, um, it's great, it doesn't get cold when you lay in it. They're lightweight, they insulate uh, the water temperature a little bit better than a cast iron tub would. And there's way more designs available, but they can scratch. Now it's not an issue after it's been installed usually, because people are getting in their bathtubs naked, but during the construction process, the delivery process, you know, if I was to move this up and down, kind of rub it up against my jeans and maybe get a button on there, we can scratch it relatively easily. So the good news is uh, you can repair them almost just as easily as you scratch them, and I'm going to show you how to repair these tubs. All right, I'm going to show you the tools I've got to work with. I've got a drill with a buffing wheel on it. I have a jeweler's rouge. Now this is more of a medium to fine grit, the green. I've got some scratch remover that's more of a, a liquid. I've got a heavy duty rouge. This is uh, more of a, um, a grainier bit for deeper scratches. I've got a bigger buffing wheel. And I've got a microfiber pad. So what I've done here is I have this tub right here. We had the Colorado Home and Garden Show and moving it, transporting it back and forth. And it ended up getting a little bit scuffed right here. So I'm gonna show you what we're, we, we've got here. We've got a microfiber cloth. And I'm gonna see if this microfiber cloth with a scratch remover Scratch removing solution will get us clear up. I'm gonna find a clean area on the cloth and I'm gonna give it some elbow grease. All right, so that's it. I got a microfiber cloth. I've got a heavy duty scratch remover available at a lot of plastics distributors. And I've got some elbow grease and you can see how we can buff out. This one will require a little bit more work, but we can really buff out a lot of stuff. Now, if that wouldn't have worked, I'm going to show you what we would have gotten next. Hang out right there. We've got a jeweler's rouge and a buffing pad. A lot of this work is almost like car detailing. Now, I was never too good at detailing cars, so my bathtubs will have maybe some swirls on them. But if you've got someone that's careful with car detailing, they're gonna be great at repairing small buffs or scratches in the tub. 